Okay, I heard I heard this was the team to interview, all right? <laughs> when it comes to water, the fishing team is no joke. Look at the hardware behind me. This shows that we got the leader, the man in charge of all these great fishermen, Ricky Edmonds. How's it going? Fine. Thank you for having us, Megan. Okay, uh, 2024 SNR Youth Bass Fishing State Champs and the middle schools. Like, uh uh, don't leave us out. You're doing it on all the levels. That's right. Sackline DNR uh, offers a tournament every year, and what they do is they tell you to bring, you know, your two top teams high school, two top teams middle school, and they all over the state of South Carolina, and whoever wins is a legitimate state champion. Right. So this year we've been fortunate, very blessed, that we went down there and we won the middle school state championship, which is the first time it's ever happened at Woodruff Middle School. There you go, middle school. And, uh, then we won the state championship in the same day for the high school. I mean, were you just like, Shh, this is great. All, all these early morning it, fishing it paid is, off. It is. Uh, the, the biggest thing with, the, with this fishing, Megan, is dedication. Mm. It's a huge thing of dedication. And I want people to realize it's not like uh, Tom Sawyer going out there <laughs> getting a can of worms and we're right, going out, <laughs> uh, you know, to, at the river. Yeah. These guys will play football on Friday night, get home at 11 o'clock. They're up at 2.30 in the morning, Ooh. and they're driving for two and a half hours. And they're watching Malachi on TV. Seeing what the weather's going to yeah, say. Yeah, and he uh -huh. says it's 33 degrees and 100% change of rain. And these boys stand out there for eight hours. Oh, my gosh. In the pouring down rain. They never complain. They never, you know, that's, that's dedication. I love it. Did you grow up fishing? Uh, yes, ma'am. My father-in-law... Uh, he was a boarder, Vester boarder, lived up there at Moore. Yeah. He was the guru of fishing coming up, and he taught me. I loved that man dearly. Yeah. Uh, so, and uh, so whenever I come up, and I was asked, I've been doing Woodruff since 2012. Right. And uh, so whenever I was asked to take over the team, it's like a little calling. You know, um, yeah. And I love it. You can I tell I love it. this man is so pat like the energy when he's talking about fishing. You, it, it just it, it makes me want to come and grab a rod. <laughs> like, Let's go. Now, does the school provide like a boat? And no. so how does that no. work? No, mostly. Oh, uh, mostly what it is, we got guys that's got boat captains, which is one of the dads. Yeah. And everything they furnish the boats, and uh, so if it wasn't for our sponsors, yeah that we give money, I give money back to the boat captains for gas, gas. hotel rooms, eats. Yeah. Uh, we do the dues, the entry fees. Uh, but, you know, we do that just on the boat and then. Right. But Megan, I got two divisions. I got a bank division, and I'm the only school in South Carolina that offers it. Some of them want to do the virtual stuff, but yeah. I, I bring these kids to a lake. We use Triple Tree. I use Joe Bones. Uh, Joey Theo has a lake. and. We'll just put them out there and let them fish and let them win prizes, and it's a point system. And the way this point system works is at the end of the year, whoever has the most points will fish what we call a classic. Right. And competitive, oh, Megan, that's competitive. <laughs> the, the, uh, the, the top 12, right. they just get, they get into it. They want, they want to win because they take home a trophy that says, I'm the bank angler of the year. Ooh. That's big. So, that's that's bragging that's rights and talking rights. So that's how I built my boating team. I love it, guys. Do y'all love it? Do you plan on maybe making a career out of it? Because you can make a lot of money. You can get college scholarships. You that's know, it. That doing is it. that. It's, I've had several of my colleges go in, and several of my kids go to college fish. Yeah. You know, so most of these guys right here started on the bank team. See. You know, so. I love it. Uh, you know, it's just just a part of, uh, uh, and and I want people to know that this community, Woodruff community, has wrapped their arms around these kids. Aww. The school has wrapped their arms around these kids, and uh, when these kids are dedicated and fishing like this, they're doing it for the school community and for themselves, for the team. Well, they got a great yeah. leader. It was so nice to meet you, Ricky. Thank you. Boys, congratulations! Great job. Two hardware. You see it. Very cool. The Woodruff High and Middle School Fishing Champs. Very cool.